Today, let's talk one of the biggest questions that fans have been asking since Milo Murphy's Law began. Is Dioji an agent of the OWCA? First off, I want to break down the animals featured in the two shows. In the show, Dioji is Milo's pet, much like Perry the Platypus was Phineas and Ferb's pet, with the main difference being that Dioji doesn't have his own B-plot in Milo Murphy's Law. Instead, he appears as a recurring character, often a du ex machina, in many situations. Dioji ex machina Murphy, you get home this instant! But to determine if Dioji is an Auka agent, we need to look at the Auka agents in Phineas and Ferb. Most agents in Alka are named by what type of animal they are, or what their name is. In Phineas and Ferb, we saw Agent D already, who is just a simple dog, but this is no proof that D.O.G. isn't an agent. After all, Pinky the Chihuahua was simply Agent Pinky rather than Agent P or Agent D. So this isn't a valid argument against why D.O.G. couldn't be an Alka agent. In fact, the only two agents whose lives are deeply investigated on the show are Agent P and Agent Pinky, although Agent Pinky only had two episodes on the show. Both pets, when around their host families, play extremely dumb. Perry rarely makes expressions beyond his blank stare and mindless walking around, and Pinky is simply overexcited all the time, rarely making sense with his actions. However, when they turn into secret agents, they are increasingly competent with intelligence matching that of the human characters. While not directly related to these two, in the Agent Doof episode, all the animals are laughing at a joke that Doof makes, clearly able to understand English if not speak it themselves. So then the duck says, Got any grapes? <laughs> Uh-oh, looks like uh, coffee break is over. But Dioji is different. He never plays dumb with his family, and is always seeking to be a part of the action. Hence, go home Dioji. In the Fungus Among Us finale of Milo Murphy's Lost Season 1, he analyzes the situation, falls on the Ferris wheel levers, and saves them. He's even able to distinguish go home Dioji from do not go home Dioji, and shows emotion when he hears these things. Also, in the Some Like It Yacht episode, Dioji is shown to be able to read a map, take a train and catch a plane, and use a parachute while skydiving. Many things that we see Perry capable of in Phineas and Ferb. So why use these skills so openly if he's an agent? All the animals in the Dan and Swampy universe are incredibly intelligent, but most act very naive since they're hired by Alka, presumably one of the few organizations that would hire animals. Let's talk the crossover though. In the few stills we've seen released, Dioji is not wearing an agent hat, despite being with Milo and Agent P. Now, this would make sense since Milo wouldn't be able to know his identity, but if Dioji used his smarts to help Agent P defeat the Pistachions, I would imagine he would be offered a job at Alka by Major Monogram. I mean, it's not that hard. Plenty of the Potted Plant got offered a job. For your valiant service in one of our darkest hours, Plenty the Potted Plant, welcome to the agency. Then a few episodes of Milo Murphy's Law could be devoted to Agent Dioji's adventures with a new evil scientist, much like Agent Pinky with Professor Poofin plots. And I'll be honest, I feel like these episodes would be incredibly fun to watch play out. Milo, however, would have to adjust to the new status quo of Dioji disappearing every day, but I'm sure they could figure out a way to work with it. Either way, I feel as if currently Dioji is not an agent of Alka just because of how he's so open with how intelligent he is with his family. However, with the crossover episode coming, it is extremely likely that he could become one. Or I could just show you this clip. Dioji is not part of Alka, but that doesn't mean that other people don't think he is. <laughs> so Dan Pavemeyer confirms Dioji is not an agent yet. Wow, that was much easier. I'm pretty sure Doof will be the one who thinks Dioji is an Alka agent since he acts intelligently and will likely help fight evil. Do you think Dioji is an agent of the OWCA? Let me know in the comments below. But seriously, if you think he is, you're kind of fighting with Dan Pavmeyer, the creator, so, uh, I'm not sure if that's a good idea. Don't give me that look! <laughs>